this. Well, maybe not album. Singles? Not where I'm going. The first U.S. Beatles single to be certified gold. Oh, wow. I want to hold your hand. That's all I got. The rationale behind that? I'm sure I have some. But I don't know. What was the first U.S. Beatles album to be certified gold by the Recording Industry Association? Please please me. How wouldn't it be? Am I missing something? Oh, the first U.S. Be oh, no concept of the U.S. releases. Again, someone born in the 70s coming to age in the 80s, well... Being 10 years old in 1985 maybe is more appropriate. It's the CDs and the release of the CDs were just the, the British CDs. So, uh, uh, the, 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 I thought the first Beatles album was Please Please Me in the U.S., but maybe it's something, maybe it's like Meet the Beatles. No, nah, U.S. releases. And you know they're getting blood out of the turnip now when they, they do the U.S. release reissues. But whatever, you know. All right. Um, what Beatles album was pressed on red vinyl by Capitol Records in 78? Um, I'm going to take a leap and say it was the... Uh, like the, It's the greatest hit. You know what I'm talking about. It's the one they, did, they just recently re-released with the new AI song on it. I don't even remember the name of the song. I'm sorry if I'm a bad Beatles fan. People were going nuts over this new song. Another breaks on the, on the school bus out there. Uh, I I wasn't totally and I mean I didn't dislike it, but I wasn't. It wasn't uh, uh, not the Dead Sea Scrolls of, of music here. Um, I did find somebody's AI remix of "Free as a Bird." That sounded a heck of a lot better. They really got the Lennon vocals away from the the, the old timey cassette to uh, to do something. It's a shame that the, the, the folks over at Apple in Apple Core don't do... Anyway, what was the question? Oh, it's that like 67, uh, da, 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 64 to 66 LP. That's going to be my guess. That's the one... What's his name? That's the one Klein put together, right? And they hated that because no one liked Klein. What Beatles single topped the Billboard Hot 100 for a group high nine weeks? Singles helps. I feel like Hey Jude might have done a done a done a uh, eight nine weeks. I'm just gonna say Hey Jude on this one. Beatles album topped the Billboard Top LPs chart for. 15 weeks. Now, everybody critically loved Pepper, but I don't know how well it sold. But I'm going to say Pepper, because that's... That's what I'm going to say. Well, it'll, it'll probably be something like Hard Day's Night, because all, all, all the vibe here is early Mania Beatles and not studio psychedelic Beatles, but we'll see. Thank you, girl, appeared on the B-side of which two V... I, okay, so I'll have to Google VJ singles because I'm not enough of a Beatles aficionado to understand that at all. So congratulations for, for you who do. Um, I like Star Trek, but I'm just doing Beatles stuff because uh, uh, I need to need to have a shout-out to Clark every, every few episodes or so. Um... I'm, I got Thank You Girl in my head. I don't even know what album that came out of. Obviously, it's early. Maybe it's with the Beatles? And what else would be on? I don't know. This is going to take me too long to try to do some logic that probably isn't going to be right in the first place. So, are we ready? Answer time, everybody. I'm excited about the answers. You excited about the answers? Everybody's excited about the answers. Hey, did I get this one correct? It was I Want to Hold Your Hand. I'll be. Look at that. And I can see the next answer on here, so that does away with the, the aspect of surprise for me. 
only because that's how I cropped my screen today. So I'm gonna, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna do this now, and then we'll all, we'll all experience the answers together. I didn't see what you just saw, but we'll see. Hey, that's two I got right. I'll be damned. Hey, I'm as this is surprise as anyone. That's three for me. The Red Album, 62 to 66. I, I knew really need to stop while I'm ahead. This, 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 this. Here we go. Look at me today. I think this is the best I've ever done on uh, Beatles trivia. And it's a category that I would not have chosen to pick myself. But maybe, I don't know. No, if it were movies, I would be horrible at it. This is the best I've ever done, Clark. This, this, this is awesome. Look, look at this. Look at, look at me go. All right. This is, you know, I'm glad I did this at the end of my day because this is quickly becoming the highlight of my day. Right here. The most successful Dave's Geek Trek uh, Beatles now, now I feel bad I didn't try to work out the answer to the last one with the thank you girl on it. I feel like I still want to do that so I can at least see. if. So I, I got to pick out a song now. Thank you, girl. What's that on with the Beatles? And that's not a hard... The question was about a B-side, right? Was thank you, girl, on a hard day's night? So I'm going to say hard day's night. All right. That that's that's my that's my leap of logic. That that's that I'm gonna I'm gonna roll a hard six on that one, and we'll see what happens. Ready? Ah, well, hey, I I, I feel good about what I accomplished. So the last question got me, but um, I I passed. I passed this. I, I can get my license now. So from uh, from me to you, and do you want to know a secret? That was the. Uh, Aforementioned mysterious. Oh, VJ, they must have had like four songs on each 45. Okay, I got some homework to do on that, but whatever the VJ single thing was, it was uh, for me to you. And do you want to know a secret that would not put it at at Hard Day's Night? That would put it in uh, the with with the Beatles, right? Okay. Um, you can look the stuff up too. I don't. I don't know if I'm going to have the energy to look it up and put a link in 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 the description. But hey, I I I I just had a good day. Look at this, greatest Beatles card ever for me. All right, I'll, I'll do some more. I'll get back. I'll get back on this. You know, and then I'll I'll have some more. Have some more Beatles fun for you 19 people to click on. All right. I'm Beatles time. I'm going to talk about some Beatles time for in my day. I'm almost done with my Star Trek The Motion Picture experience, but we're, we're going to do some Beatles trivia. Because right? I like doing different things on my channel. That's what I'm about. That's that's why I, I'm not going to make any money off this. Uh, this is uh, albums and singles. I suck at this.